to new watches, I'm Richard. In our previous videos, we did a product overview and we took you through some concepts and terminology within Saferon Accounting. Right now, I'll be taking you through the dashboards to give you a better understanding of how they work. Nothing is more important to you, the business owner, than the ability to understand what is going on in your business. You should have a good understanding of the key areas of your operations, including your cash flow position, your financial performance, and other key areas like money owed to you. All of this information is readily available in the Sage One Accounting dashboards, all presented in a graphical and easily understandable manner. Let's take a look. This is Sage One's default dashboard. The dashboard is something that summarizes information so that you can see the highlights of what is going on in your business. This is key for any business owner who wants to keep in touch with the performance of the operation. Taking a look at the setup on screen. I currently have four widgets set up on this dashboard. You can always add more if you wish. On the top left widget you can see your to-do list. This shows important things that you will need to follow up, including quotes and purchase orders outstanding, customers who have not paid you, or suppliers that are yet to be paid. It originally shows in summary, but you can always drill down to more detail if you like. On the bottom left widget, you can see a graphical representation of your sales on a month-by-month -month basis. It even shows the comparison to the equivalent month in the previous year. On the top right widget, you can see your bank balances and monitor your balance over the last two months. You can also view your top customers by sales, showing you where your revenue is coming from. This dashboard is customizable to suit your business's needs. You can just go to your dashboard options and select add a widget. Here you can choose any other widget that you want to choose to appear on your dashboard. This means that you can decide what information you see and only display details that are important to you. The quality of information does not end there. You can also drill down on information in the dashboard. Having a look at the sales history widget, if I want to see more information on the May 2014 sales balance, I can drill down on that bar and arrive in the daily sales view. I can then drill down further, showing the invoices making up the balance, and even get to the line detail for a particular invoice. Now back in the dashboard, I can see that this drill down functionality is available throughout the application, wherever you see the hand icon. This will allow you to drill down to further detail. These drill downs will give you valuable insight into what is happening in your business. We have provided additional dashboards for you as well. We have provided specific customer, supplier, item and financial dashboards that are relevant to those areas of your business. Having a look at the customer dashboard, here you'll see quadrants specific to customers. You can view your top customers by sales or outstanding balance. There is a graphical representation of your age analysis and there are quick links to your most important customer reports. The same is available on the other specific dashboards. In addition to the dashboards, we also have the My Workspace screen. This is a fully customizable graphical view of the most commonly used tasks in Sage One, allowing you quick and easy access to your most important screens. You can even customize the My Workspace screen by dragging the icons to different locations on the screen. Or, you can rename these icons to make them more understandable and relevant to you. So in summary, the dashboards are where you come and see summarized information of what is going on in your business. Another example of our Sage One is simplifying accounting. That's all for now. In our next video, I'll show you how to create suppliers, customers and items. For more information, visit our website or tune into our YouTube channel.